Get up! Get up, you arid pig! Come on, let's go! Let's go! Shut up! On your knees. Get on your knees! This is the light of the world. We're ready, let's go. Lollygops, towel heads, camel jockeys. You are not Americans. You're parasites living off our citizens. You cheer when our GIs die in Iraq. Why do you live in our country if you hate our way of life? You think we're scared of your jihad? After today, be scared of us. This is our jihad. God bless America! The victim had his wallet and his cell phone. His name's Eric Kalabi. He's 26. He's from Bay Ridge. I'm going to run him through NCIC, and I'm going to give the phone to Taru. They cut his head off. Yeah, just about. An Arab banner. Somebody was definitely trying to send a message. United Americans for one America. What is this place? An old fleet garage. You can't see the entrance, so they obviously had privacy. Security guard started his shift at 6, found the body as soon as he got here. All these bloody footprints, they're smeared, so we're not going to get a good impression. Knife went through the carotid. When? No rigor. Three hours ago, tops. Your victim struggled. I got some hair samples, not his. Oh, and he's wearing a wedding ring. How do you tell this to the wife? You all right? Yeah, fine. Captain? Franks, public information. Ma'am, Dearn, this is really bad. You have no idea. Seen a TV yet? No. News organizations in the early hours this morning. A homegrown version of terrorist videos we've seen with increasing frequency. The effect of this one, as you'll see, is the same. It's to create fear. Lollicops, towel heads, camel jockeys, you are not Americans. You're parasites living off our citizens. You cheer when our GIs die in Iraq. Why do you live in our country if you hate our way of life? You think we're scared of your jihad? After today, be scared of us. This is our jihad. God bless America! The rest, of course, is too graphic for us to air. But suffice it to say... The world doesn't need to see this. Especially in front of our flag. It's terrorists, presumably Americans. Personal, between friends. Well, Mr. Fode, when one of the friends ends up with his head cut off, personal piques our curiosity. There was talk. Eric being out late. I asked him if he was having an affair. And Diane's my cousin. I told him it had to stop or, or we'd have to go to the imam. Who was this woman he was seeing? He wouldn't tell me. He got defensive. I never saw him like that before. Someone you knew? I wouldn't know her. Someone not from your community. She wasn't Muslim. Look, Eric's dead. It won't help Diane to know he might have been cheating. Good. Excuse me, I gotta get to work. So Kalabi steps outside the faith. I want to put names to the numbers on the apartment bloods. Maybe he called this woman from home. I want to check his emails from his home computer. Let's get a search warrant. Why are you doing this? What could you find in Eric's things? We're doing our best to find out who killed your husband. You're not telling me the truth about everything. Are you telling us everything, Miss Kalabi? Do you have a warrant for this search? Of course we do. Could you stop for a second and think about the message you're sending? When you search the victim's house, that makes him look guilty. That isn't our intention, sir. You're not naive. What does this say to every Muslim in the city? Ed. Excuse me. Back of the closet, buried under clothes, prepaid cell, untraceable. The Quran. Quran's not news, it's a Muslim household. But inside, there's some folded papers, extremist literature. Guys, 32 cookies, all sites in Arabic. I checked the URLs against JTTF lists. A lot of these are anti-American sites. And the American websites, extremist literature. We know where this is going. Don't put him in a suicide vest just yet. JTTF doesn't have Eric Kalabi on a single terrorist watch list. Well, neither were most of the guys from 9-11. Oh, so you're just going to judge on color. You know what? Just forget I said anything. All right, I'll forget I'm black and I'll forget you're white. What? I defend racial profiling? I'm a racist? You obviously have something to say, so just say it. OK. You get pulled over by a cop just because you're black, that's wrong, and it sucks. But if I'm alone at 1 o'clock in the morning and three black teenagers are walking towards me, 
I'm going to cross the street. I mean, hold on, I got a text. The victim made five calls to other prepaids, called 911 day he was killed. Let's go to one PP and listen to that switchboard tape. And don't worry, my ears are colorblind. It's happening in 36 hours. Please, you stop calm them. down I'm and tell me your name. I didn't mean to get involved. Look, I can't talk right now, OK? Look, we need you tonight. No, not today. Uh, tomorrow? OK, whatever you want. 10 in the morning, Union Square by the W Hotel. I'll be in a blue suit. You can. OK, I got to go. Kalabi didn't give his name. Not to the 911 operator and not to the detective it was routed to. The detective made the meet no one showed. He was already dead. I was wrong. This guy wasn't a terrorist. He was an informant. We do work for the Port Authority. Subways, bridges. We manufacture and install cameras, build network interfaces. The city said we missed a couple. So they came to check the contracts. What's this about? Wait a minute. You said they came to check? Yeah, Eric and one of the associates. Do you remember this lawyer's name? I wasn't paying attention. I've got video on the outside doors if you want to take a look. We make cameras. They're everywhere. Here we go. Front lobby. Pause it. Can you blow that up? Sure. That's our friend from the restaurant, the one that had the argument with Eric. Ben Faoud. You have audio? Uh, yeah, sure. You sure you have an appointment for today? Yes. And where did you say you were from? We're from Hoffman Gold. Let me call Mr. Aldridge. I don't see you here on the list. Our appointment is for today. OK, stop it. Can you get us a copy of that audio? Sure, not a problem. We should try to match this audio to the voices on that beheading tape. You cheer when RTIs die in Iraq. Why do you live in our country if you hate our way of life? From the Airway Security Lobby. Our appointment is for today. We get the word our in similar contexts. Why do you live in our country if you hate our way of life? Our appointment is for today. Our, our appointment is... Not even close to the frequency patterns. It's not this guy. Try the second guy. You think we're scared of your jihad? After today, our appointment is for today. Today. Today's nearly identical. If the context was better, they would be identical. Good enough for probable cause. The FBI staked out the restaurant. Ben didn't show up for work, and he is not at his apartment. Nothing personal here. No family photos, travel souvenirs, nothing. He travels light. Hello, found his passport, and your boy gets around. Afghanistan, Syria, Pakistan. I mean, these ain't your basic vacation spots. Well, Geraldo would be proud. These were all under the floorboards. Dozens of cell phone SIM cards. And schematics for a Stinger missile shoulder launcher. I got water pipes, radiator, nothing. Wait, I got them. Two bodies going down the stairs, east corner. I still can't believe we're storming a mosque. If we were looking for any fugitive in any other place, we'd do the same thing. We need the warrant to go inside. Signed? Thanks. We got the search warrant. Hit it. for the murder of Eric Kalabi. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can be used against you in a court of law. You have the right to an attorney. If you cannot afford one, one will be provided for you. Eric was my friend. Why on God's earth would I hurt him? Because he warned the police about your plan to use Stinger missiles. Your voice matches the one on the videotape. You had the knife in your hand, and this is only going to make the ID clearer. What are you people talking about? Eric was murdered by white racists. Do white racists distribute DVDs of beheadings to deter informants? 20 of them, Ben, found in your backpack inside the mosque. You put them on the street, the people get your message. You're insane. The DVDs belong to Ray Alcini. You people shot him dead at the mosque. You saw him. He was a whack job. He's nuts. Where are you hiding the stingers, Ben? I swear, I don't know what you're talking about. 